something unlocks after you hit level, uh, after you ma- beat the main char- character arc. Okay, so you got a crystal, right? Mm. What job did you get the crystal? It wasn't from another job. Oh, okay. So you have to beat the main, the main story arc. Have a chance at it. No one is loving me, and this is not acceptable. Yes, you guys are really unacceptable. Yours is filled with countless mysteries. There's only one which Valiant Heart wishes to solve. Element, wheels, bash, all gibberish, utter gibberish. As I live and breathe, a warrior of light. Haven't seen your like in years. Not since bloody Cartonell, certainly. I see. You refuse to conform or deny my assessment. Keeping a low profile, are we? Very well. I shall speak of this to no one. By the by, my name is Valiant Heart. So it's a pleasure to meet you. Now look at the two of us. Two veterans burdened with experiences beyond the common men's ken. I say we should be friends, you and I. To that end, I shall share with you my reason for being here, and in so, deepen our bond. Tell me, have you heard of Winebud? He is an explorer of some renown ten years ago, though he regrettably retired and passed on not long ago. It is said he discovered a treasure worth a hundred million gil. That's right. One hundred million gil. Winebud called it the most precious secret in Lalafolo III, who was Sultan of Belada some hundred years ago. Just think, we might do with such a treasure. I say we. For should you aid me in my search, I would gladly so share the spoils. You'll see no guidance and no help. Will you do this? No. I beg your pardon. Did you just say no to a hundred million gil? I did. Because there's no way for me to be successful. Messenger from the Twin Adder came to the Walking Sands while you were in Mordana. I wasn't privy to his conversation with the Addis Eden, but I, I did see the look on her face when he took it, after he took his leave. Something's definitely amiss. Could it be the exile of summoned Garuda again? Or, or mayhaps the Imperial forces have been sighted within the Shroud? Well, whatever it may be, I'm certain, absolutely certain, it's nothing you can't handle. Now go and ask Addis Eden if there's anything you can do. To the walking sense, the waking sense. There's something you can do. the Swasmis. Oh, the seeds have carried you back to me, I see. I caught wind of me, your swell, matey's triumph, and your contributions as well. You've made me for a fine pirate yourself. I Bringing the pirates together with promises of treasure and glory, that's the Bloden I know. I from what I hear, it's already caught the ear of many a buccaneer. Bloden and I go back a ways, we do. We were comrades, friends, and I even more than that on occasion, if my memory serves. I've got nothing but respect for the man, but building the proper army out of old buccaneers won't be easy. Any idea he comes up with, you can bet Admiral Mirwood's already had it. Treasure and glory are all well and good, but he did do well to know what truly calls a pirate to the open sea. Freedom. And that's something the Maelstrom can never offer. I can only hope that others of me kind answer the call. I... Then and only then can I be sure me decision to part with me yellow jacket comrades was the right one. So, Bridal, 
Ah, Pieter, so good of you to return. Tells of your deeds precedes you. Your glimpse of Liminses in good hands allowed us to tend to matters of import elsewhere. But I'm relieved to have you back with us all the same. Much work remains for the realm. Is that Vistola? Vistola would entrust you with the titanic task of defeating the greatly strengthened Titan. So both Ifrit and Garuda are now vanquished by your hands. Truly, you have earned yourself a rest. Would that the luxury had time to enjoy it. It pains me to say that Titan has also returned, and with a vengeance. As was the case with his primal brethren, he's grown stronger than he ever was before. When I went about my investigation, all indications suggested that the kobolds were nowhere near ready to resume their summoning rites, but it turns out they were deceiving us. I should have known better. The kobold subterranean domain runs deep, and they easily hoard crystals without being none of the wiser, and a vast hoard it must have been. Till now, Garuda is the most powerful amongst the three recently active primals, but according to our latest readings, Titan has usurped that honor, usurped whatever. A primal's might is determined by two factors, the amount of crystals it is gorged upon and the fervor of its believers. I would like nothing more than to measure precisely how strong the Lord of Crags has become, but I fear the time for such prudence has run out. We have already received an official request of assistance from the Maelstrom, and as you might expect, it is addressed entirely to you. For your previous encounter with Titan, you traveled to his demise by way of the Aetherit, first located by the Company of Heroes. Sad to say, this Aetherit no longer seems to respond. But do not despair, for the Maelstrom have reportedly found another in its place. You will want to speak to Commander Rikik at Maelstrom Command for the details. I cannot express this enough, or stress it enough. But Titan has grown fearsomely strong. See to it, you spare no preparation. Okay, I'm tamed and registered, so I don't need to see that one. All right. Solar. What's up, Minfilia? I knew this day would come, and I prayed it would not come so soon. We have reason to believe that another primal, or an entity resembling one, has been summoned in Gridania. Thine arrival is customarily timely, Pieter. The etheric waves leave little room for doubt. Thy talents will be needed ere long. If there's truth in my suspicions, tis a familiar foe we face, though one quite unlike the Lady of the Vortex. We dare not draw conclusions without evidence, but Owen Gander says the readings bear strong resemblance to ones observed more than four, more than five years ago. Though I'd hoped Muggles guard beyond such follies. Suffice to say, this disturbance, disturbance warrants a full investigation. Look, thy presence hath been requested by Commander Hilario. Pray hasten to Gridania, Pieta. Ida and Palpamo will rendezvous with you there. May you walk in the light of the crystal. Look. Being the solar. That is the, the one that has no end or help. I don't even want to worry about that. <laughs> A 
Carbell Mines. And unfortunately, we'll have to take a quick break. All right, I'll be right back. All right, let's talk the Stone Torch. An adventurer. Baseless rumors notwithstanding, I can assure you that our meager talents, that your meager talents, are not needed here. No hierarchies have returned to the mines. And even if they had, the store and torches would be seeing to that threat swiftly and ably, as is our want. Hmm? <clears throat> and not what you just heard. It's most certainly not the torture scream of an unfortunate miner being consigned to the mob of brother, bloodthirsty giant birth from unforsaken death. Forgotten for taking that. Seven hell, that's true, all of it. We thought we'd seen the last of them, but we were wrong. Horribly, dreadfully wrong. Let down our guard, we did, and now Copper Bell is overrun with a damned legion of the fiends, each one nastier than the last. We've already lost scores of our men to the chaos. The few that have got returned alive claim that even the once docile Spriggans have gone mad, falling upon the poor miners in droves. So much for being harbingers of wealth and fortune, eh? Stone torches are loath to lean on the strength of outsiders, but I cannot in good conscience place full pride before the lives of good men any longer. You reclaimed these mines once. The torches, nay, the entire nation of Ulda, would be forever in your debt if you could perform the deed again. I beg of you, friend. Banish those fiends to the depths, that they may never resurface. Cover bell mines hard, now accessible. Sorry about that. One of my tennis players was asking questions. I needed to answer that. All right, entrance. Let's do Copper Bell Mines hard with a party of other players, shall we? It's light party time. 